Good morning. I hope you're having a beautiful day. I want to read you this morning out of Matthew 5, 44 and 45. But I say to you, love your enemies, bless those who curse you, do good to those who hate you, and pray for those who spitefully use you and persecute you, that you may be sons of your Father in heaven. Matthew 5, 44 and 45. Crucifixion is an evil death. The position of the victim on the cross results in asphyxia, prohibiting adequate exaltation and inhalation of air, breathing in a laborious and speaking insufferable. Yet in the midst of this agony, Jesus ministered to humanity's vilest and also to the brokenhearted. This is the way the cross is often seen as a symbol of Christianity. As the guards divided his garments by casting lots, Jesus said, Father, forgive them, for they do not know what they do. Luke 23, 34. Even from the cross, Jesus spoke to his heavenly Father on behalf of his enemies. We don't want the searchlight of the cross examining our hearts, telling us that we're guilty before God, The blood of Jesus convicts us, but it also cleanses us. The blood of Jesus brings reproach, but it also brings redemption. The blood of of Jesus frustrates evil, but it also brings forgiveness to the sinner. The blood of Jesus cancels God's judgment on the repentant heart. Who do you need to forgive today? Have a Jesus-filled day.